10, an update to a story that tugged at a lot of heartstrings. It was last month a stray dog fell through the ice into Lake Michigan near the marina in Racine. A woman saw that dog struggling to live and called police who pulled him to safety. Tonight, that dog who escaped death now has a forever home. Katie Crowther in the studio with more on this, Katie. Stephen Carroll, after our story aired, hundreds of people expressed interest in adopting the dog. Tonight, I met the woman who finally got to take him home. For Brenda Thompson, it was love at first sight. More? You like those, huh? Yeah. For Michigan the dog, the feeling was mutual, thanks to treats. He's such a handsome guy. The Humane Society named him Michigan after his ordeal last week. Photos show him trying to stay afloat in freezing Lake Michigan, eventually making it out alive. Brenda saw his story on today's TMJ4 and rushed to the Humane Society, where Michigan was recovering from hypothermia. I threw some clothes on and came straight here. <laughs> I was here pretty much every day since I saw that story. No one ever came forward to claim Michigan, and Brenda was at the top of the adoption list. Finally, she gets to take him home. We're going to get home and go for a nice walk. His bed is all made up. He's got brand new bowls, and so he's good to go. A second chance for Michigan, who's shaking off the scares of his past and walking off into the sunset with his new best friend. And Michigan now has a sister, too. Brenda has another dog at home, a black lab, that was rescued after Hurricane Katrina. We're giving them a lot of congrats tonight. Carol and Steve. That's a wonderful Good story. Dog. Thank you, Katie. Good dog.